The Prince of Wales has touched down in Singapore ahead of the third annual Earthshot Prize Award ceremony. Upon arrival, Prince William, 41, said, It's fantastic to be back in Singapore for this year's Earthshot Prize Ceremony, after 11 years. Singapore's bold vision to be a leader for environmental innovation sets the standard for others to follow. He went on to say, I am grateful to the Singaporean people for hosting us this week. Let us all take inspiration from the fantastic work being done here as we celebrate this year's Earthshot Prize finalists. Prince William's brainchild Earthshot aims to find solutions to some of the Earth's biggest environmental issues. Launched by the Duke and the Royal Foundation in October 2020, the Earthshot Prize has been inspired by President John F. Kennedy's Moonshot Program in the 1960s, which urged millions of people to support the U.S. space program. It is based on five Earthshot goals, protect and restore nature. Fix our climate. Clean our air. Revive our oceans. Build a waste-free world. Five £1 million prizes will be awarded each year for the next 10 years, providing at least 50 solutions to the world's greatest environmental problems by 2030. During his jam-packed first day, the father of three traveled to the Jewel in the Chani Airport to officially commence the countdown to Tuesday's award ceremony. The iconic landmark, opened in 2019, is located at the heart of the airport and features an array of attractions including a mirror maze, a canopy park and an indoor waterfall which was lit up green to mark Earthshot's arrival in Singapore. Royal well-wishers couldn't contain their excitement as Prince William paused to take selfies and spoke to gathering crowds. During one particularly heartwarming exchange, he interacted with an eight-month-old baby called Albon who flashed a cheeky smile before gently biting down on the father of three's finger. Unfazed by the playful interaction, Prince William continued to smile and spoke to the tiny tot's parents. Singaporean mother Lena Soho and her two children Rania and Rauf subsequently presented Prince William with gifts including a portrait of the royal on a horse. Prince William was accompanied by Hun. Mrs. Sim Ann, Senior Minister of State at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs Ministry of National Development. A former civil servant, she has been serving as Senior Minister of State for National Development since 2020 and Senior Minister of State for Foreign Affairs since 2021 where she is the lead minister for the UK-Singapore relationship. Later in the evening, William was presented with a tembusu tree in the surrounding gardens by the CEO of Jewel, James Font. This is the first time that a tree has been planted at Jewel to mark the visit of a foreign dignitary. Prince William traveled to Singapore without his wife, Princess Kate. William and Kate's eldest son Prince George exams coincide with the Earthshot Awards, and it's understood that the princess has stayed in the UK to support the young prince.
George, 10, who is in year 6 at Lambrook School in Berkshire, is likely to be sitting entrance exams for his future private school. Whilst George isn't likely to move schools until the age of 13, most entrance exams are usually sat three years in advance. On Tuesday, Prince William will attend the Earthshot Prize Award Ceremony. The glittering evening is set to be a star-studded event with the likes of Emmy Award-winning actress Hannah Waddingham taking to the stage in her role as host. Speaking ahead of the event, she said, I am absolutely thrilled to be hosting this year's Earthshot Prize Awards in Singapore. The work of the 2023 prize finalists is a hopeful reminder of the power of optimism, innovation, and human ingenuity. She went on to say, it is an enormous honor to be joining forces with the Prince of Wales for this exciting evening and to play a part in sharing the finalists' inspiring stories and solutions with the world. 